In this video, I am going to show you how to use LinkedIn in mails to get more clients from LinkedIn. I'll also show you a hidden LinkedIn in mail strategy that we use to get over 20 clients in 2023. So what even is LinkedIn in mail? LinkedIn in mail is like email, but instead of sending somebody a connection request and then sending them messages, you can just click on the message button and that allows you to send somebody an in mail. Let me show you how it works. So I just go to LinkedIn.com. Let's say I want to do some prospecting. I want to get in touch with certain people. So then I'll have to first search for the people I want to get in touch with, right? Let's say I target a lot of sales leaders so that they can buy my software. The way it works is that I just search for, you know, let's say VP of sales, right? So that will show me a lot of these people that I want to get in touch with. So I'll just search by people and yeah, that's it. I can do either of two things. I can either go to Kirk's profile here. I can try to hit connect and then, you know, Kirk may or may not connect with me, but I can also, you know, send him an email directly. So all I have to do is go into his profile. Instead of clicking the connect button, I'll have to click more and click on the message Kirk button and that's it. I'll be able to send him an email, right? I can just type in whatever message I want to type about my offering uh, and then just send from there, right? And it doesn't even, you know, consume any credits, right? It's a free message. But that's not how it happens for all the people in my list, right? If, if I go to the list here and I have to message somebody uh, like Jimmy, I can just go to his profile and I can try to hit the connect button, um, the message button. You know, it takes me to a sales navigator interface and it uses some of my credits. So that's what an email is. I can try to message somebody on LinkedIn, but it may or may not, you know, consume something called credits. So what even are these credits? In-mail credits are a paid feature of LinkedIn. You won't get it if you are not a LinkedIn Premium member. If you are a LinkedIn Premium member, LinkedIn Premium gives you 50 credits per month and the credits keep renewing up to three months and at which point they reset, right? So that means that you can have a maximum of 150 LinkedIn credits if you're not using them because they won't allow you to keep them indefinitely. Now you may be thinking, okay, this is great, right? I'm getting 50 credits per month. I can message 50 people every month and try to get leads. Well, not so fast, right? Because outbound is very hard. If I want to reach out using LinkedIn and try to get customers, then I need volume, right? If I'm reaching out to only 50 people every month, like even in the most optimistic case, I'm getting a 10% response rate, which means that out of 50, five people are getting back to me. Out of those five, some of those responses may be, hey, I'm not interested. Like Kirk might just say, I'm not interested. Why are you reaching out to me, right? If I'm getting just five responses, that's not enough for me to land customers. So I have to do something else. That is where this hidden strategy comes in, which is the LinkedIn open in mail strategy. So let's get deeper into that strategy. If you look at all of these people here, some of these people have this gold icon and some of these people don't. So if they have a gold icon, they're very likely to have open profiles, right? Which means it won't use any in mail credit to send them an in mail, right? Which is amazing. And the limits are way higher. You can send 800 open in mail messages a month. So what I can do is I can just, you know, lock myself in a room and start messaging people, right? I can just go to Kirk's profile, open it up in a new tab, go to chat's profile and just start messaging them because it doesn't take any credits. All it takes is my time, right? To write out a message, I can just copy paste, um, you know, the message and just say that, hey, Kirk, we have a sales automation tool that can help your sales team get more leads from LinkedIn. Would you be open to taking a look? I can do something like that and I can do the same for Chad. I can do the same for all of these people, right? But that's the catch, right? It will take a lot of time for me to actually go ahead and write out these messages, right? I can't be copy pasting messages from one person to another. It will take me a ton of time. So that's where our hidden strategy comes in and our hidden tool comes in, which is sales robot. Let me show you how it works. But before that, let's look at the two key elements that are needed to get us get success with this strategy. Tactic number one is the copywriting aspect. Let me show you an example of what that looks like. So if I send Chad a message, an in-mail message with a subject on a body, this is how it'll look. So let's look at it from Chad's perspective. So there was this person who had reached out to me and this is, I feel, a great example of a copywriting technique that really works. So this person is Emiliana. This is our subject, right? So whatever you write in the subject shows up like this, yeah? And then it shows up here as well, plant trees for Earth Day and the rest of the body is here. So he, she sent me a great message, right? She says, hi Saurav, we're approaching Earth Day, which is a great trigger event. At evertreen.com, we partner with companies like yours that want to be more sustainable by planting a tree for each product sold or as a gift for new clients, which is a great hook. I'm very environmentally conscious. I volunteered you know, during my college days. So this is a great, uh, you know, cause very near to my heart. She goes into the pitch, right? She, first, this is about trigger event plus what she does. This is the first line. In the next line, you will track your forest from your custom forest account. 
video and satellite updates. So she's tying my investment back with real ROI. Tree prices start from one pound. Shall I give you more info by email or in a quick demo? You know, she makes it very easy for me, right? She gives me two options. She's not asking for 30 minutes of my time. If I want a quick demo and get a quick demo, she can, she can send me more info by email. So which is, I think, a great call to action. Then she says best types in her email and her full name. And then I really love the PS line as well because it. if I didn't get the time to fully read it because most people just glance through the email, they don't fully read it. I know what she does, right? She supports corporates along their sustainability journey. So this is a great message. So if Emiliana has to reach out to a lot of founders, she has to, you know, copy paste this message and send it to all of them. This is where sales robot comes in. So let us show you how we can help people like Emiliana and maybe you reach out to all of those people that you really want to reach out to and get leads, right? Because you don't have time to probably copy paste to each of these guys. So you just hop on over to sales robot and then you create something called an in-mail campaign. Just click on get started. Um, that will take you to your account. And from there, you just have to find your list first. All right, so you just add your LinkedIn account to the tool. You put in your LinkedIn credentials here and that attaches the robot to your LinkedIn account, right? So this is what you do. Once you get in here, you, you create something called a campaign. So you click on create campaign. Uh, let's say I'm an advanced user. Uh, you know, you want to send in-mails, uh, you know, hit save, add from LinkedIn search and you just give it this URL. So let's say I want to reach out to all the VP of sales about this initiative that I have. Hit save and configure settings. Uh, here you can just make this, uh, you know, make these changes. So you're looking at premium only and sending as in mail, right? Save and continue. And yeah, that's it. From scratch, you send an in mail and just type out your message, right? So let's say I want to talk about sales tool for your team so this is the subject so this is what will show up here right and then the body which is hi first name and something like hi first name are you looking for sales tools to help you get more leads from LinkedIn. And then I can type in something which is a trigger event, which is cold emails and cold calls are not working like they used to, right? That's it, right? That's the message. And then I can give more information. I can even maybe sign off and that's it. It will start pulling in all of those people and send out 30 to 40 open emails every day without me having to lift a finger, all right? how this whole in-mail strategy works and over time if you're reaching out to enough people you know they'll reply to you they'll look at your message and over time that's what gets your results try this in-mail strategy and let me know how it works for you we even have a 14 day free trial on sales robot if you're looking to run in-mails just for 14 days hop on over start a free trial and see how it works for you all right that's it from me in this video take care bye, -bye.